Howdy and happy Sunday. As you can see since my last update with the Lexus, uh, the hood has been painted and it looks phenomenal. I had a guy that works at a body shop do it as a side job for him and you can see just how new that looks compared to the rest of it. It matches the paint super well and I'm super happy with it. However, pretty much everything on the front looks new except for the fog lights. So I'm going to get around to replacing those. I was looking online, I found some Depot sets. Depot is the brand that I have for my headlights and they were $310 for the pair of fog lights which I thought was a bit absurd. So I went on to Amazon and I found these. Some Chinese knockoffs, but they look pretty clear, they look pretty good, so I'm going to try putting them in, I'm going to show you how I do it, and then hopefully it'll be looking almost brand new from the front on. Now I've not yet gone underneath and taken a look at it, but you can see the old fog lights there versus the new ones here once again. Crystal clear night and day difference, but looking on this, you can see there's a little mounting screw here on the side, i got to take that off, and then it looks like a little pinch tab right up here maybe. I believe that's all it takes to hold it in, but I'll double check once I get underneath, so let's take a look at what we're working with. So laying down here and taking a look underneath of the car, you can see there's your fog light housing right there. 10 millimeter screw that I was showing you right over here. Screw, bolt, whatever. Gonna take that off real quick. Take that off because I need to reuse that. There you go, I'll set that here aside. I'll get my electrical connector out right here. Little button that you push down right here and then you just kind of wiggle it out. So I'm Wiggling it now as we speak. I'm trying to get that off and it's still wet underneath of here because I did go through a car wash earlier and that's why my front end's so clean. Let me pull that out. And now that the electrical connector is out, all that is left is this pinch tab up here. So I just gotta pinch that, push it in, and then you can see the rest of the housing is loose, so that just pushes right out. So it's just a little bit of working right here. I'm trying to get it, I might need both hands for it. Nope, pinches in just like that, and then the whole thing just pops out like that. So this new set which I got, I will link in the description below. You can see it does come with new bulbs as you can see by the connector right there, so that's already installed. I don't have to worry about that which is nice. I'll take that one, I'll set it right here and put it right next to the old one so you can just take a look once again at the difference. Now I'm going to take my new one and I'm just going to pop it in right there. Should feel it click in. Take off that plastic and look at that. Oh yeah. Now you can see up here that little pinch tab that I pushed in is completely in, so that's good there. I'm going to take my 10 millimeter bolt, try to line it up here. It's kind of hard to see from down here, but it feels like it's threading in. Is it? Maybe? Yeah, that's definitely threading in. So let me just grab my socket wrench here with the 10 millimeter socket on it. I'm just using a small little quarter inch drive. Throw it up here and get tightening down. It's starting to get tight, which means we are good to go. I'll take the electrical connector, connect it on the same way that it came off. Try to get it to the point where it clicks. Might have to use my left hand for that, which is currently holding my camera, so let me put down my phone real quick. And now that the electrical connector is in, I'm gonna pop around front, I'm gonna turn on my fog lights and test them out. From auto, I'm going to switch to the on position, fog lights on, walk around up front, and look at that. Now that is crystal clear compared to before. It's nice and bright too. Take that one compared to the old one which is all blurry. And now I'll switch out the other one real quick. So once again I'm going to do the same process just this time on the passenger side. I'm going to take my electrical connector out and I'll pardon all the mud underneath the year I had it off road the other day which was a good time, but I still have yet to clean out the actual undercarriage. That water up in my hose right there. See that? Look at that ridiculous. But anyways, pull out the electrical connector real quick. I had to put the phone down because that one did not want to come out. Once again, you just push on this little tab up here, right here, and then you pull down on the sides. So now that I have that out, I'm going to remove the 10 millimeter bolt right here on the side of my fog light housing. Take that out, put it aside so I can reuse it. And then last but not least is the pinch tab located on the upper right side if you're laying underneath. 